Hey everybody, how you doing? Dash and Dave here again. All right. Happy Friday morning, March 18th. Doesn't look very pretty out here, does it? No, it don't. Uh, freezing rain, rain, snow, sleet. It was sleeting like a mother over there in uh, Nevada about 10 minutes ago when I left. So uh, it's about 10 to 8. Uh, what are you doing out here so early, Dave? Well, we have $2.50 peak pay. Started at 5 a.m., goes to 11. Times two. So <laughs> that's crazy. Uh, I'm guessing there's a couple of reasons for that. Number one, it is Friday. This is, remember, spring break, so the kids are gone. That means a heavy customer base is gone, but a lot of dashers are gone too. Been slow all week long. When you look at the schedule, there's a lot of time blocks available to reserve when usually it's just a blank page. Also, we are hosting some games here at uh, ISU, Hilton Coliseum, NCAA Women's Basketball Tournament going on. ISU is a host city. The women, actually, ISU women play Arlington, I believe it's Sunday, tonight or Sunday, I might, oh, I think they play tonight at 10 p.m. The first game's at 7, so hopefully they also, you know, hopefully they win, and then we'll play Sunday night. So anyway, uh, I haven't seen a great influx of fans from the other teams. Wow, look at that, nobody here. Gas uh, was 387 at the high, I believe, here at my Sam's Club. It's now at 367, so 20 cents less. I let Speedwagon just about get down to fumes here because I, I knew it was going down. I was keeping an eye on it and everything. So, okay, so, you know, I think DoorDash was maybe concerned about fan base coming in, you know, for the NCAA tournament. I really don't think that's going to pan out too much. Uh, the weather's kind of crappy. Spring break is slow. Not many dashers out there, you know, so they're motivating us. They threw on 250, and then somebody said, double it up. Thank you very much. All right, so let's get Speedwagon filled up. This is what the radar looks like right now. We're the blue dot in the center. Everything's moving north, so really, you know, the pink is freezing rain or snow. We're in the green, which is rain. It's moving up out of the area. I'm not sure what's to our south. More rain to our south. But anyway, I got an extra pair of sho shoes and socks in case my feet get wet. So anyway, okay, so we'll fill up speed wagon, we'll rock and roll. Not sure which way I'm gonna play this strategy today. I think if I were to take off the peak pay and just look at the at the at the job offer minus the peak pay like I've done before, I think I'm gonna be throwing everything away. There's gonna be some cheap getting their food delivered today in a timely manner because of $5 peak pay. It's gonna be a $2 order with $5 peak pay, which is a $7 order, and they're gonna be making out like bandits, and they're gonna get used to that, kinda of wonder why it doesn't happen all the time. But anyway, you know, usually uh, no tip, no trip. So I'm not sure exactly. Maybe I'll take off 250 off the pay, and then apply my metric, and go from there. That's an idea, that's an idea. We'll play around, we'll see what happens. Ouch! Even at 20 cents off of what I paid the last time, $82. Holy smokes, that hurts. I filled it up though. I I put it right to the top. All right, 8 a.m. Go to the Dasher app. Cool gray. Dash now. How many hot spots do we have? Panera Bread. The other day, for a split second, it said, sorry, there's no hot spots. <laughs> I think it was a glitch, because it filled in real quick, but that was pretty bizarre. Sorry, there are no hot spots. What are you doing out here? Okay, so two hot spots, Panera Bread and Tropical Smoothie, down here in the Duff Zone. I think I'll try to stay in the Duff Zone as much as I can today, but we're going to let Tony follow, lead us around. Letting Tony lead us around. You know, where is the money? I think that's a good little strategy I was thinking of there, is taking 250 off of the, the offer 
and then applying my metric. So it'll be the base pay, the customer tip, $2.50 peak pay. I'll apply the metric, then all the other, then the other $2.50 peak pay will be bonus money. Because uh, we, uh, the mileage factor has not been very good lately, and that's because I'm taking orders that I might not take otherwise. You know, you can't turn down $10 that's going seven miles or six miles. You know, so that's just the way it is, where when it's busier than hell, you go, nah, I'll wait for the really good one. So, you know, it's a matter of uh, changing up your strategy and working with what's being given to you, and that's the only thing that you can do. So, anyway, let's rock on, and hopefully we have a good day. All right, guys and gals, that's all I've got for you today. Hopefully you can take something from this video and put it to use for yourself. Thanks for coming along for the ride and hope to see you next time.